All right. So I have this Ibertuff cordless power battery soldered iron. Um, it takes three, three double A's, which I don't particularly like. Three double A's is five volts. So let's see if we could do something about that. It'd be really nice if I could round that out and put an 18650 in there. I'm sure actually, I actually could do that. Well, is this thing cool? Oh, cool. All right, well, let's see what's in here. Let's see what our options are, bro. That'd be really cool to stick an 18650 in there. So, that's an awfully thin wire right there. All right, so 18650 it wasn't exactly what I was thinking. I had a different plan, and I just jumped it up by accident. Because an 18650 is only 3, 7 volts, 4 volts. But let's see if it actually works. Light's a little dimmer. It's brighter on that setting. So let's go, let's go to this setting. And see if it gets hot enough to melt that. I'm just wondering. It should be about there. It does. Yeah. So an 18650 does work. And these. Amazing, huh? The silver solder. Yeah. So that's one option. Convert it to an eighteen six fifty. Hmm. The other thing I was thinking of is USB. And using an external battery since I have tons of those things. Let's see about that option. Going USB. Because you're going to say, well, then I won't be a cordless. Yeah, but it will because. The whole point of cordless with a sign iron is not needing a 110 volt. 
Why is this hot? Oh. Oops. Oopsies. Is not needing 110. And you've got these all over the place. Now, I don't know if one and if a half amp is, would be good enough. <clears throat> well, let's give this a go. Where would I have the wire exit? I just because I'm gonna have to cut a notch on where it exits. I'm gonna have to open this up. Huh. I could actually just use that too, right? So, you go from the red wire, red wire to the positive, black wire to the negative in there. All right, so let's see. Now we've got this on here. This presently turned itself off because it doesn't see any draw. So let's turn it on. Turned on. We got our, our other light, and let's go to the other one. We got our other light. I wonder if that just does the brightness. So anyway, well, let's make sure it'll melt on her. I mean, it's pretty damn obvious it will, but, you know. So now, where do we bring the wires out? Where it's not going to interfere with the battery, and it doesn't look like we can go anywhere. Oh, come up here. But then that's going to interfere with the battery there. Huh. About the only place is up here. So let's make sure. And it is working now, of course. Turn it off. And check the wires. These little tiny wires are not hot. So it can definitely handle it. Now I just have to decide where. Oh man, I made these and I put some lubricant on these things on the inside and they just slide. I don't know what I did. Now I need to decide where to bring this wire out or just make this thing never use 
AA batteries, which is fine with me. <clears throat> you know what? That's what I think I might do. I just might make it never use AA. Because this thing just heats up so fast. But I don't want to. I don't want to keep wasting double A batteries. I have billions of. Billions of these. And 18650 chargers. So you know I just. I might just say screw it. Just go right up the middle. Yep. That's the red. Green and the white. This is also a ground. I don't need it. Um, is there any way I could reuse this? I don't think so. center of this unless I want to rip it apart <clears throat> I might just I might just cut a notch there how do you hold this thing you hold it this way so I might just cut a notch right there for it to come out but let's get this thing in um so that pain in the ass with go now I need to cut ourselves out a notch over here shoot shoot how do we hold this hold this this way I'm gonna cut a notch over here that's where it is I just want to come out here <clears throat>
Okay. Now we do the old. The old school don't pull on my wires loop. Know what I mean? Ah, uh, shoot. This is going to pinch that when it comes in. It's going to pinch that. Uh, so, I'm going to have to do that over here. Alrighty then. Alright, Mr. Knot. Like, I don't know what has just happened in there. Good. Boy, you just unmade cordless corded. Why would you do that? Assuming I didn't put those in wrong. Yeah, now we got a 5 volt one. Do they even make USB ones of this? <laughs> Do they make USB ones of this that are cheaper? <laughs> I don't care. crap is just stupid there it is puppy works so now it's not cordless <clears throat> but to me it is cordless because i have tons of these five volt sources tons of them all right so that is complete Yeah, why? Well, I... 